Majority. The one, the majority of Atlanta or the majority of Wisconsin? The majority of U.S. black men. No, no, no. We got a segment of our region. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's hard on Atlanta. <laughs> you see? I, I, honestly, are we talking I'm about not... Atlanta or are we talking about... Green Bay, which one? Majority of black men. I'm just I'm not taking no accountability. These women are horrible out here. I definitely agree. But I know that if these men were leading, the women would have nothing to do, would have nothing to but follow. Olive, I, have a I, I don't know, Q. I think I don't have a question. Uh, okay, so Anton had just spoke earlier about how women are basically deciding a lot of the political races, right? So based off that example, what does that mean? That means women are making a choice and they're choosing who they want to lead them. So when it comes to you asking, do we have more leaders? I don't think it's that we lack leadership. I think that women are doing the same thing with black men when it comes to who they're choosing to be their political leader. They're just not choosing us. It's not like there's not good me black men out there. It's, it's plenty of good black men out here. But I can't force you to choose me to lead you when you okay. don't think you even need me. Wait, wait. Back, yeah. Same question, Rockstar, and then Cameron. Rockstar, do you well, think I majority of black men are good leaders? Huh? Do you think majority of black men of today are leaders? Not well, your, not your, where, not where your they clique. From? Where, where are they uh -huh. from? I got majority of black men in the U.S. Where did he from? Yeah, hold on, good question. Now watch how I answer this. Majority of human beings in general are not good leaders. Okay, are not thank even you. leaders. Thank Leadership you. is a quality that just not everybody's going to have. So our individual goal is to just become good leaders to our children and our wife. Now, I think there's a more than an abundance of them than, than um, we're giving credit for. Mm -hmm. So that's how I. Uh, yeah, but Q Q can be a lawyer though, man. At the same time, because it, even though she asked that question, are some women willing to be led? Is the question exactly. also? They, they, they would. I think that's, they would. That was what my point. Go ahead, was. Cameron. That's the real question. Wait, I do think they women, would if they do, didn't get attention. Women want to be led. Go ahead, yeah, Cameron. Was... Work, they... Go ahead, sorry. Yo, what make that argument different? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> let Cameron go. Let Cameron go. Go ahead, Cameron. Yeah, um, I was just gonna say that was my point to your um, to the point you made, Q. Like you can, you know, you're saying that you know if we had better leaders in the men, that you know maybe the women wouldn't, you know, be in sex work and things like that. But I mean, you, you I mean, if it's kind of, I mean, you can't you can't lead a horse to water, like they say. You know what I'm saying? You can't make somebody do what they don't want to do. And I'm I kill that, that notion right quick. Wait, wait, let her finish, Rock, 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 let her finish. Rock, oh, okay. oh, he on a delay. Let her finish. Yeah, um, but yeah, I was just saying, you know, I think that the them wanting attention and or the insecurities or whatever they're going through as to why they're in the industry is bigger than them having a man in their life that could be leading them. Because who's to say that they don't have men in their lives? They're strippers that have fathers, that have good fathers, you know? So I don't think it has to do anything with if they had a man to lead them because some of those women do have men in their lives and they still end up becoming, you know, whether that be a single mom or, you know, a dancer or whatever that looks like. So who, who posed that point? Hmm. I said, who posed that point that the strippers would lead? I said, if we stop giving them money, they stop. No, no, no. He was saying that if we had better, if women had better leaders, that maybe they wouldn't fall into that industry. Oh, well, the leadership comes from men living more righteously. That's it. But I don't think that's true because, again, it doesn't matter how you lead your life. I'm still going to do what I want to do. When and that's fine, but then that goes back to what Anton said. Then, if if you leading your life and you gonna go ahead and mess up, I could look at you and watch you doing that. But the more men that go ahead and be Anton or follow what he's saying, or the more men that think like what I'm trying to tell you, is the less men that you have willing to participate in the economy that is sex work. Mm -hmm. I, I still, I still think. So you I think still that think. if men weren't showing the 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 women in that industry attention they wouldn't do it at all they i think that, that nobody does any job without getting paid to do it i don't think it has anything to do with money I for think. some of them like i said i think some of it is attention like some of them Wait, so like i don't it. cameron if they weren't getting attention from the men what do you think they're gonna do 
they're going to stay in that job or well, they're gonna find, or they're going to find another job that a man will be more suitable to give them attention I mean, I feel like that's hard to answer because there's, I mean, it's not like all men go to strip clubs now. I mean, it's not like there aren't other options for careers now. So it's no. like. The ones that do, though, they know I how think, to make I it rain. I think y'all dig too deep with this strip club thing, man, for real. No, I'm just. It's an example. It's not just strip club. It's only. I, I get that. I, I get, I get that. But at the same time, it goes back to my question about are women willing to be led? You can look at some of the single parent households. Look at the kids in the school that don't mm. pay attention to their teachers and don't follow authority. Who do you think are raising these kids? Kids. So they're the getting from somewhere. More women. Kids, I know what saying, but that's who's More the, women. The let me let me ask y'all a question. Okay, let's say I'm single, right? Let's say I was single, and I want a good wife. I want to find a good woman. How many? How many good women do I need? One or a fifty or a hundred? All I need is one. So I think a part of the problem when it comes to the situation is, is we so we be so our people or single people are so focused, we get caught up in options. And to me, that's a part of the disease in our community is that we're looking for so many options because we got so many standards and and, and everything to where Anton made a statement before all you need is one. All you need is one good woman. All, all one woman need is one good man. We got to stop focusing on how many is out there and just find you a good woman, find you that good man and cherish it, value it. Stop, Because a lot of times we devalue a person who's meant to be in our life because we value the options more than what's in front of us. I, I, I get it. I get the points that's being made. But I still did, I don't agree how it's men fault though. I just don't because AJ did start his argument off says men fault. Then he went to say his thing about the product and he also said Anton is gonna kill me on this point. So he did say it was men fault. We got to that from that from here. So I just don't I still don't see how it would be a, a men's fault or someone making a choice to you know or what we're saying the strip club or all this other stuff. You know I'm saying you're grown. You make a choice to be a stripper. Uh, there, uh, there are other jobs that you can do. Nobody's telling just because you saying, "Oh, we go to you know to McDonald's." That's staying open because we're buying burgers or whatever. That's just crazy. Yeah, I you know agree. what I'm saying. And so I, 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 I see where y'all can, uh, coming in from that, and I'm not, I'm not getting to that space to where I want men to be responsible for women. I'm not saying that. I want men to be responsible for men and what their success is. But I think when you have more men being a good example, people just going to follow him anyway. You know what I'm saying? There's a bunch of people that Anton will never get to meet. He'll never talk to that are going to look at something different because he said something in passing. That's going to be a light for them to follow and go a different direction. We just need more of that. That's all I'm hey, saying. Jay, I got so you don't believe that there's enough like good men right now being an example? Not that's visible. I think that you know what I'm saying, to be a good man and to be like on the forefront and say some of the stuff that he's saying out loud, that's the reason why I come on this. That you know what I'm saying? That's the reason why I have these conversations and I'm willing to approach them from either side so I can make sure that all of the points and all of the voices are being heard. But yeah, it's it's people are losing their job for less. You know what I'm saying? Like because they saying something that goes against what's popular in society today. So basically, we had more good men like Anton. Anton has people that follows him. Anton can say the sky is pink and they gonna agree. So that's why I said I don't we think had more leaders. It's not more true. Good it's not true. It's not true. I think women need to stop turning down. Question. Women need to stop turning down and friend zoning the good men that they do meet. That's more of the issue. I, I, no, no. I, I don't, I, Go ahead, Mr. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Mr. Go ahead, Mr. Go ahead, Mr. Uh, Go I don't think women want to want to be led because when it comes to leadership, you have to follow. And in this generation, women don't want to follow no one. Women want to do their own thing. They want to make their own money. They want to be the boss. They want to run everything. They don't want to release control. 
If you're going to go on in a man's leadership, you have to lose your control. And today, women don't want to do that. 